Here's another really important question we've received. Why don't we have a conceptual design of the LNG facility? I mean, how are we able to vote on something that we don't have the design for? So that's a good question, and it's something that's very important to make clear. So we're involved at a very early stage in the project. The very beginning of this is an idea. And because we're involved so early, it gives us the opportunity not just to wait until this work is done, but be involved directly in the formation of what these things will look like. And that's how we've approached it. So we have a team of experts that have aided us in making sure that our concerns are expressed very early, but are also there for us to ensure that we can make sure that the project fits our values and our expectations for the use of our land and resources. And I think we should hear from them. So let's hear from our experts. What we're doing here is we're creating a co-management process where Huayat is at the front of the decision-making process rather than hearing about what's going to happen after the fact and seeing the devastation. This is an example where Huayat's going to be driving the bus making sure that the impacts of this type of project are minimized, that there's appropriate accommodation, and that there's free prior and informed consent of hereditary and elected leadership and citizens before anything happens. So how is this different? This is very different because we're at the front of the process rather than an afterthought. And we've seen so many examples where uh, Huayet or other First Nations are at the tail end of the process and all the main decisions have been made. Here we get to design the baseline studies to make sure that they're comprehensive and thorough, not some sort of window dressing. We get to look around the world for the world leading technology and make sure that it's, ex it's incorporated into the project. We get the opportunity to see that the construction, monitoring and decommissioning of the project happens in a way that protects Hoyt interests. You can't have that role without being at the front end of the process and you can't be at the front end of the process if the project is already designed and in the bag.